Welcome back, scale modelers. You can see I have made some progress with my building, and there was something wrong with the video take. Sound was gone, so I will record it now and put it over the picture that you are watching now. You can see I have glued some rocks, sand, uh, rumble. Um, and glue that down with the mixture of 50 now 57 uh, percent water and 25 percent PVA glue and uh, use the pipette and you see that I glued it on let it soak in and let it dry for 24 hours so it's rock hard and this is the last steps, almost the last steps of the diorama. Um, yes, and turn around. You can see how it's on every corner. And at the back, I must have some more rocks and sand, and maybe some uh, wooden uh, sticks on the blowing up house. So you can see, I give you an um, uh, overview of uh, what is the building. Uh, in every corner and side of the diorama, I have made some rocks, sand, um, some furniture. See, um, yeah, and the build is done. And I think it's uh, completed. And now I will paint it and give it a basic coat first with my airbrush and you can see that later on in this video welcome back so you can see I uh, completed the diorama put the soldiers in and sheet lines I had a comment on my previous video from uh, Simon Camp Monolith I think his name was and he suggested uh, maybe you can uh, put the lantern street light at the front of the diorama and not at the back. And that was and before I built this. And yeah, and now it's complete. I think, yeah, he's right. Because at the back, he, um, I not say it in English, but the view is going to the street light and not to the, the German soldiers uh, eating. In the diorama so I put it at the front and yes it's uh, looking better it's nicer and I think uh, he's going to do it uh, in that place thank you for signing Cam Buller yeah great guy nice videos just see his uh, YouTube channel uh, great stuff and yeah the time is now to uh, paint it also, I have bought uh, some uh, paper, uh, wallpaper, and um, that I will use in the walls at the back, the high walls, and um, to give some uh, yeah, nice feature in it, so it looks like uh, it was a house. And um, it's come from Unicorn Models, a great uh, scenery and uh, 135 scale also smaller and bigger i think on my side it's from belgium and i met them in uh, a local no, not a local in belgium uh, if you want to see more of that go to his website Can live. 